This is one of those games where it's like you're speechless. Um, I thought our, our effort was really piss poor. We didn't come to, we, we weren't a professional team today. We didn't come to do our jobs today. Um, and that was from the, the very start. That first group started that. Um, and then it trickled down as well. Um, and when you do that, you have you have losses like this. So. I guess can you just walk me through like what happened in the second quarter? It felt like you know, even by the third you were still struggling with shots. Was there anything that yeah. was doing to kind of get you off balance? No, I mean I think we were we were getting we were getting some good looks. Again, first quarter we got good looks. We got to the rim. We had two feet in the paint. Our post players got touches. Our guards got in the rim. We didn't make shots. We didn't make shots, and they pouted, and we pouted, and as a result, it carried over. That type of it doesn't matter anything you do in life. The energy that you bring it it dissipates. You know what I mean? And so like it just we just pouted, um, and we never was able to really turn the tide. I thought we actually turned the tide when Nas came in. I thought Nas brought some good energy. I thought Lowe brought some good energy, um, and that kind of helped us get back going. And that may be a thing that was on me because I started the fourth quarter. Um, I went back to my bigs, my my starting post players. Um, in the fourth quarter after those two had so much energy um, in the third quarter. And so that may fall on me where I should have probably stayed with them because they, they played with the energy that we needed to play with. So you got the shots that you wanted. You yeah. Really, you talked about going east, west, and going Yeah, I think in the first quarter we got the, we got the shots that we wanted, and, and then because they weren't falling, I think we stopped trusting what we were doing. I think in the second quarter, yes. We started taking nothing but outside jump shots rather than trusting that, okay, we were getting in the paint. Post players were getting post touches and guards were getting two feet in the paint on their attacks. Um, and I don't think, I think the second quarter, we just didn't, uh, we didn't trust, we didn't trust that, that the, the game plan was working because we weren't making, making those shots. Of course, we saw Alicia go down. Is there an update on her? She's fine. She's fine. She's fine. She's fine. She's fine. She's fine. I think just not making shots kind of had something to do with this, but um, forced 14 turnovers and got four points off those. Yeah, um, our transition. Uh, we just weren't great. We weren't great in transition. It was a lot of. Uh, lethargicness, you know what I mean, tonight in terms of running, um, even in the first quarter, like sprinting back on defense. Like they got, they missed a lot of shots. To be honest, they should have probably been beating us and beating us way worse than what they were beating us in the first quarter. They missed a ton of shots in the first quarter because we didn't sprint back. We didn't get matched. We didn't load up. Um, and we quite, quite frankly, we looked tired. We looked tired, which is odd to me because our last two practices, they weren't, they weren't rough. They weren't tough for them. <laughs> you know what I mean? Um, so I don't know why we were so tired and why we couldn't get back um, on defense. Coach, uh, second straight game, we're out third quarter. I mean, we're still in the game, but it's like the third quarter it takes us a minute, it takes us a while. Yeah, to yeah, it. yeah. We, we got to get on that first group about their energy and how they're starting these, how they're starting the quarters. Um, they're just not starting it starting it well right now and with a focus that you need to be able to win games this this league is very very hard every game is going to be a tough game so there's a mental fortitude that has to happen or ha has to ha we have to have um when we start the game um throughout the game and especially when we're starting halves it doesn't make things any easier when Bjorn Stewart has a game like she had 25 and 10. yeah yeah um yeah Stewie is Stewie's one of the best players in the, in this league. Our job is to try to try to make it tough on Stewie. Um, and I thought I thought we did we did a decent I thought we did a decent job of just making her make tough shots. You know what I mean? Um, she had some attacks that were that were Stewie like attacks and different things like that. But there weren't a lot of plays where we weren't there. Which you know what I mean? That that's okay because you know what I mean. Stewie is as good as she is because your job is just to make it tough. Then we have to stop the others like we can't let somebody like Fibich come in and have five offensive rebounds because it's momentum swingers you know what I mean um things like that otherwise I thought I mean John Quill was what she was only four for nine meaning she only took nine shots six for 14 four for 13 and to the and they're starting guards you know what I mean two for nine I think Kayla Thornton was so 
that's just that's just part of it. Stewie's gonna do that. We gotta do we gotta do a better job on the others. And then offensively, I thought you know we needed to do a better job of moving the ball um, at times. AP, from a player perspective, what do you feel like going on with the team right now when you're out there on the court? Um, I think we need to find our identity a little bit. Who do we want to be as a team? You know, um, the coaching staff is putting us in the right positions, and we just have to have that. Like she said, the fortitude to go out there and hustle, hustle hard, play hard. Um, and I think we will. I think we will. Yeah. Talk yeah. to us, Lo, 10 minutes tonight. How did it feel out there? You gave some good, you got plus, minus, or six, or four, or whatever. Talk to us about your play today. Uh, it felt good. Um, my teammates and my coaches gave me uh, a lot of confidence. So. I just went there and just trying to do my best, give some energy. Um, that's what I, I like. I could have done. So um, I'm just, of course, I'm happy uh, that I got some playing times. But you know, just uh, hopefully I helped a little bit the team in a difficult time. Two more in the room. Go ahead. Um, we know you gave the update on Alicia and we're happy she's doing well. Is there any update on Jordan you could give and how she's doing at the moment? Still progressing. Any questions about the game? Uh, Gary Sean. Yes, Coach. Um, so we saw LA get in in the last couple of minutes. Yeah. Uh, I, I just wanted to know, like, hmm, how do I how do I write this? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> LA didn't get in into the last final couple of minutes. Just ask your question. What are you What are you asking? Yeah, just, just are you like, asking why LA isn't playing? Is that what you're asking? Right. Right. Why, so just why say that. LA getting in the game earlier, I guess, or why, why wasn't she an option earlier when you guys were down double digits in the third quarter? Uh, I thought Nas played great. Nas plays that position. There was no reason for me to take really take Nas out, and when I did take her out, I went back to my starting forwards. Right. So there's your answer. Okay, guys. Thank you very much. Appreciate the time. Thank you. Thank you.